hi guys welcome back to my channel i swear to you guys what i'm about to share with you i cannot make this ish up do you know how they say when you can't beat them you join them well this is literally what kimmy cakes is currently doing now there's an article from the daily mail that is saying that how Kanye West's new wife, Bianca Sensori, comes from a family just like Kim Kardashian. No, this is a huge PR move coming from Kim K's camp. Because guess what? Initially, we have always known Kim Kardashian and her family to be that family in the pop culture. Bianca Sensori is a triple threat because Ye has been pushing and promoting that his wife has a natural beauty, not carved up, you know, and plastic up like Kim and her sisters. And when that worked, what Kim and her sisters attempted to do was to basically push the narrative that they're beautiful, they have their money, and he is a bad guy. And if you marry to him, you're going to end up with nothing but pain and heartbreaks. But what Kim realized is that the internet was not having it. And the moment that Bianca's family was seen around Ye interacting with Ye, it seemed as though Kim slowly began to realize that, you know what, just as though you and your family was able to accept Ye, there would be another family that would accept him because at the end of the day, Ye is a genuine, beautiful person that anyone would be happy to have amongst them. So when Ye and Bianca's family met up, you know, it seems as though Kim expected, you know, Bianca and her sisters to have a reality TV series. She didn't see that happening. But what happened for a fact is that the media kept reporting on Bianca. And when they're not reporting on Bianca alone, the media kept reporting on Bianca Sensori, family, upbringing. We are now seeing more of the mom, the sisters, and all of that. So Kim knows that with these girls, they're young, what the media has been asking for. This includes social media. Social media has been asking for a very young, influential, dynamic family. Bianca Sensori and her family covers all of that. Also, social media is not accustomed to a mom looking like Bianca's mom, who is naturally beautiful and who hasn't pimped out her daughter. Because for years, we have been getting the Kardashian Jenners in our faces, using black men, telling lies, and just promoting fake beauty. Here we have Ye with his wife, Bianca Sensori, and Ye has been promoting that natural bodies are back. And it's something that is making people realize that, you know what? We've been really too hard on ourselves because look at Bianca. She's beautiful. Look at her sisters. They're beautiful. And one is just skinny, slender, and she's pose. She doesn't learn a thing, and she's not seeking attention that's what we need to get back to reality because when we were in touch and in tune to reality we were much happier and he is demonst demonstrating that by not wearing shoe because when you don't wear shoe it is basically saying i'm grounding when you ground, you get in touch with reality so because he is starting a movement and has started a movement what Kim is doing, she's using the media to tie herself into that movement. And in my previous video, I said to you guys, everything that Ye does, Kim copies. And here is another copy move coming from the Kardashian Jenner camp. Because one thing Kris Jenner has been exposed to do, and that's work with the media to push out a story that they want to ensure people sees so when this report comes out saying that oh my god guess what you know what bianca sensori family kanye's wife family oh my god oh her family is just like kim k's family bitch no it's not 
Don't fool yourself. It's not. Because the reality is, even though Bianca is from Mafiosa, right? Her family has mob ties. The reality is, you know, either of them is not something that, you know, to, is, is to gloat about. But the reality is, most people would rather be in a family where they're protected, where they're safe, safe, where they're not being pimped out by their mom, where they're not forced to pose nude, but rather protected, properly schooled, properly sheltered, and still have an amazing bond, a family that is low key, that doesn't go around the internet spreading mess, nor telling lies on a black man about being exploited when you know you released your sex tape. So the reality is, even though they're using the media to say, oh my God, they're just the same and Kim's sisters are as stunning as Bianca's sisters. Heck no, because the reality is you cannot compare real with plastic. And that's just the truth. I believe that plastic surgery is beautiful. It has helped a lot of people. It has saved a lot of people. But at the same time, Kim Kardashian and her family They've been out here promoting unrealistic beauty for years that has impacted people, people's mind to the point where people believe that they had to look like a Kardashian in order to be accepted and in the process has lost, has lost their lives. No, the reality is, did Kim tell them to get plastic surgery? No, but did Kim influence them to get it? Yes, she did. And we have to take those things into consideration. There's no way you can compare a family that is filled with lies, mischief, and is just being a hot mess, you know, sex tape, pornography, to a family where the mom and dad ensured that their daughters got proper schooling and are not brainwashed into the belief that plastic surgery fixes this thing. Popping pussy online fixes thing. Showing your ass is the thing of the day. Bianca and her Bianca's mom and her dad ensured that they were cultured into being amazing ladies and not just internet thoughts, right? But let's talk about what this media is saying and how they're saying that Bianca's family is the same as Kim's family. Because the reality is, we knew this would have been coming, but we know better and we know that you cannot compare plastic to realistic human beings, right? Now, they're saying that in one photo of Angelina shows the Bernard posing on a Gold Coast balcony dress in a cleavage bearing denim corset top and black leggings in another she's seen flaunting so they're using these words to give comparison because guess what the kardashian jenners are known for flaunting their stuff but these girls are skinnier which is bianca's sister they're skinnier their physique is unique this is what they were born with they're not flaunting, they're just posing versus a Kardashian who flaunts because they know it's fake, it tricks the men, it gets people to gloat over them. So the media is being very strategic in using the words to compare a Kardashian, to compare um, a sensory. But does it work? No. But let's continue. Now, they're saying in another, she is seen flaunting her felt physique in a sheer white unitard with a racy cutout and plunging neckline paired with unusual boots. Look at the words that they're using because this is what the Kai Jenners normally aims for and as such they want to say oh my god the Kai Jenners covers up they were beautiful and they're ladylike and all of that right but we know it's not the truth. No, they're saying that speaking to the Earl son earlier this year, Angelina asked for privacy, but admitted the family was happy of Sensori's marriage. So you can tell that the family's asking for privacy is the family saying, 
we are not into the media. We're not looking for clout. We're not looking for attention. Please leave us alone. Now, what the media further does is to include some photos, right? You can see Kim, Chloe, Courtney, and Kim, you know, at a ball. And this was many years ago, and they were nicely covered up and they looked decent, right? Then beneath that, what did they do? Put two photos of um, Bianca's sister. And they say, throwback photos posted on social media show Bianca posing and partying alongside her sister, pretty sibling, Alyssa, and Angela, who, um, who like the Kardashian sisters, appear, appear to like the finer things in life. So here they go again with a sister by sisters comparison because these are all the photos. So they're doing the sister by sister comparison saying that, oh my God, the sensory sisters, they do enjoy the finer things in life, just like a Kardashian. But if you look at the sensory sisters, their styling is more relatable to society than Courtney and Chloe. Courtney and Chloe's look, it's not bad. It's clean. It's beautifully executed, right? But if if the public should vote and say what was more relatable to you growing up, it would be Bianca and her sisters. And the reality is Bianca and, and her sisters, they have money, could dress up as expensive and as fancy as the Kardashians but they choose consciously not to do so because what is the end game of that? What's the purpose of that, right? Now, the media continue by saying, it's very exciting news for both my sisters and the family because they're talking about when they spoke to Alyssa, right? They're saying, she's saying that, you know, it's exciting news for her family, but they're asking for privacy like the Los Angeles-based clan, the Century Sisters grew up in affluent neighborhood. They were raised in Ivanhoe, of one of Melbourne's affluent and established area, and later moved to a two point eight million dollar Halfington home, where their mama, mother actually Alexandria, still lives. So they are giving you the consistent comparison for the media to say, you know what, for people to say, you know what, the families are just the same. Bianca is just like the Kardashians. They are no better. They have they all of their money. They're all um, flaunting Prada bags because here the media gets into what um, they spotted Bianca's mom in, driving a Mercedes Benz. Her Prada bag was $5,300. So immediately, what they're saying is that, you know, this is just another family like the Kardashians. So you guys don't need to gloat over them because the Kardashians are just the same. But the reality is, Bianca's sensory family is a lot more relatable. They keep it low-key. They could have been flashy with 5, 10, 11 cars in their driveway, but they choose not to live that lifestyle and they choose not to flash their wealth in front of people's eyes. So you cannot compare a family that is in tune to reality versus one that has disconnects from everything that is real, including the natural bodies that they were born with, right? So, this is what they're doing. Kim cannot be TA. No way, no day. She's talentless, her and her family. So, what's the next move? Why not compare that my family is the same as the family that Kanye married into? Because that's all she can do. Copy yay. And that is what exactly Kim is doing at this point. But I want to hear from you guys because all this comparison, it's interesting to see because it was just like a few hours ago, we said this would have happened. Here it is happening and I find it to be very sick, very disturbing and it's nothing but far-fetched and far from the truth.
two different families, two different upbringings. The girls, even though they're adults, they're not pumping and filling up themselves with plastics and other fluids. So there's no comparison in this case. But let's hear your thoughts and get the discussion popping. Give this video a big thumbs up and see you all later. Bye, guys.